James Samalski for EA Sports. We're in Long Island tonight. It was a gorgeous day earlier this afternoon, and now it's time for Islanders hockey. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. The Blackhawks take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Puts it on net. Oh, and it stays out. He got a piece of that one. And he slides it quickly to Pellet. Gaining momentum up along the side. Takes the feed at the point. Handles the pass. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Perry's gained the line and on the attack. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. And now it's over to Nelson. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. And he takes the pass. Moves it to Hall. With the stop. Takes the puck along the boards. Save made by the goalie. Man, James, he shows incredible quickness right there as he makes one and then the second save. Lots of time left in this period. Still scoreless in this one. Chicago's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Quick pass across to Mayfield. Chicago's got a hold of the puck now. Moves it quickly over to Donato. Chicago's got the puck against the half wall. Here's a short pass to Romano. to the body on the play. Picked up along the boards by Donato. Play blown dead, let's get the call. Mayfield's hit, not viewed positively in the eyes of the officials, and charging is the call. Pellick's known for great stick checking in his own end, guys. He's got that stick him up zone ability, and that's his poke checking skills that he uses to fend off an attack. Pacho's gained possession, and his great work inside the face off circle pays off again. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. The Blackhawks take possession in the defensive end. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. Takes a shot. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. Doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. And it's a quick pass to Hall. To his teammate. Oh, what a save in front. Goaltender covers it up, and we'll get a reset here. Donato's looking to win this draw and this man advantage here. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in their own end. Scooped up along the wall by Horvath. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. And they get the puck out of the zone, and that's a break for the squad. And it runs the post! A huge opportunity to go ahead in this game, James, but it hits the pipe and out. Now they're chasing. Horvath's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Islanders win it in the defensive zone. From the open ice, they gain the line. Jocelyn for the puck, and it's knocked away. And here's a pass to Donato. Down the right side and into the zone. The Islanders have it now. And a successful clearing attempt. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. Johnson's into the offensive zone now on the attack. Great defensive effort with the stick. Off his stick, and that's blocked from someone in front. Quick pass to Romano. Right up the gut into the offensive end. Mayfield's almost back on the ice. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. And goes taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Pass it up ahead. Quick feed to Romano. And the players whistle dead. Here's the call. Donato's not going to like the call, but the officials see tripping on the play. The first penalty kill of the game 
for this group here. Nino, their penalty kills right for the bottom of the league. But this group's got a lot of confidence, a lot of energy. They just might be able to shut down this power play unit. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Shot to Noise him on the slopper. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Johnson's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. Offense is on faceoff and he wins the draw. Tonight. Here they already lead in this one, and they've been dictating the pace of play also. Well, they get the game's first goal midway through the period, James, but I liked their game right from puck drop. I mean, the way that they started, the urgency around the puck, they pounded it, they had a heavy forecheck, and now they get rewarded for their efforts. Grabbed along the board by Radish. Moves it to Wallstrom. The Islanders move the puck in the defensive zone. Wallstrom's running and gunning tonight, James. He got the go-ahead goal earlier, and now he's looking for more. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. one nothing the score. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. That's gloved by Morazic. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Officials are set. Players seem ready. We're ready to get this thing back underway. Barzell's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Denies him again. Oh, man, he's so dialed in. Makes consecutive saves there and keeps his team in it. Great reach with the poke check by Nelson. Oh, that goes off his mask. You might see that's using his head. Well, James, that brings new meaning to putting everything in front of the puck to make a save as it goes off of his mask. Not sure if he's rattled right there, but he shakes it off and he gets the save. Nice job tying up his opponent. Gauthier's crossed the line and is on the attack now. What a stop! And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. The Islanders take possession off the faceoff. Shuts him down. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Perry's taking it from his own end. Puck scooped up by Murphy. Passes ahead from the right side. Oh, look at this, here they come, they've got numbers. Gets it over to Dobson. He carries the puck up along the wing. Tried to get 2 Q with it and loses possession. Dobbs got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one and the puck dies on his stick. Moves it quickly over to Perry. Now a quick pass to Murphy. Too many bodies in the way. Oh, hello. Comes up with the puck with a quick steal. Nice flick of the stick. New York's got a hold of the puck. And he takes the feed. Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Johnson. Jostled off the puck. The Islanders take possession in the neutral zone. Reads the play and forces the turnover. The Blackhawks have been playing great defensively. Their six are in the right position, but they need to make good on them. This game is awfully close. Quick pass to Paul Mary. Takes the puck. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Brasic. And there's another stop. No room for that one to get through. to end whistle. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Blast from the blue line. Denies him on the play. Picked up 
along the wall by Entwistle. And that's deflected off someone in front. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Pushes it across to Wallstrom. Trying to get free! Oh, he hit the Right on the doorstep! The rebound there to be had! And they made no mistake about tucking that one home. This is actually a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. The Islanders extend the lead by two here in period number one. Well, I really like their play up to this point in the first period here, James. I mean, they've got themselves a two-goal cushion because they've been relentless on the puck. But now it's about continuing to be urgent, not getting complacent, and sitting back, continue to attack. Anderson. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Great reach with the stick by Athanasiu. Here's a shot. We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. Past the midway mark in this period, the Islanders now lead by two. Pachos won the draw and they're on the attack. Great glove save! What an incredible save in a high-danger scoring area. I mean, right in the slot, he's in perfect position to make that glove save. New York's high activity in the offensive zone has resulted in them leading here midway through the first. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Kurashev's got it in the defensive end. Moves it to Jones. One times it. Too much traffic in the lane. And that pass is redirected. And he hangs on to the puck. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Slides it diagonally to Clutterbuck. Pass back to the point. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Mayfield. Here's a chance in front. Moves it again. And that's stopped. Tries to get the puck to Mayfield. And that's knocked away. Moves it quickly over to Seitzev. Handles the puck. Mayfield's got it now deep inside his own end. Puck grabbed by Wallstrom. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Wallstrom's known for his creativity and he tries one too many moves there and he loses the puck. From the back of the cage with the puck. Oh, you'll win respect for your teammates doing that. What a block. Chicago's got it behind the net. Denied by the goaltender. Here's a short pass to Wallstrom. And he loses control of the puck. Pokes it away in his own end. Angles it over to Perry. Chicago's got it across the line. Poked away in the defensive end. The Islanders will play it in their own end. The Blackhawks pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. And he takes the feed. Odd man rush. Oh, what a smart heads up play. And the puck's knocked loose. Slides it across to Lee. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Puck goes out of play. We got a face off coming up. Getting into the later stages of this period. 2-0 is where we sit. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Works it across to Bull Duke. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. New York's got the puck against the boards. Oh, they'll be forced to start over from center as the puck leaves the zone. Quick shot! There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. The Islanders have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities and as a result have the lead. Johnson's won the draw inside his own end. Slides the puck across to end whistle. He's had a lot of offensive zone possession time, and you gotta figure he knows he's one goal away from his next milestone. Cover, cover. 
Barlamov's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. And the centers glide towards the dot here as we got a face-off set to go. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. The Islanders have it from their own end. Good hit to knock the puck loose. It whistles, picking up steam. Wax it into the offensive zone. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Keeps possession. Chicago's got the puck. Big time save by Varlamov. Gaining momentum up along the side. With possession along the wall. Quick pass. Oh, it goes right off the post. New York's run another one off the post, James. How many is that now? But listen, they're getting opportunities and they're really firing it towards the net. I really like their game tonight. Great poke check on the reach. Quick feed to Martin. Here we go, odd man rush here. A little dipsy doodle and he loses possession of the puck. Let's get the call. The Islanders have been handed a two minute penalty for tripping. for this power play unit of the game and we know they're ranked toward the bottom of the league right now all they have to do is trust the process do what they've been practicing during their off days and hopefully capitalize on this opportunity here puck cleared from the defensive end grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage chicago's crossed the line and on the attack moves it to hall denies him Barlamov dialed in and anticipating the play so effectively, making a huge save from a dangerous spot on the ice. Bedard's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Gets it out of his own end. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. The Blackhawks carry it along the wall. Denies him in close. A timely save is everything to your team, and this goaltender, he bails his team out. And that slides right out to center ice. There you go, period number one is done. We're gonna come back in just a quick moment with period number two. Stay with us. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. Chicago's won the opening draw and their power play rolls on. Tries to feed it over to Hall. Let's move to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. And he gets the job done. Big thumbs up clearing that one. Moves it quickly over to Jones. Chicago's got it along the wall. The Blackhawks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Oh, great save by Varlamov. Here's a short pass to Jones. Oh, he got pummeled by Varlamov. They're like a swarm of bees out here with this pressure. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Pachot's called for tripping. He's off to the box. The Blackhawks will get a small sample size of a five on three. Well, a short five on three here, but you still have a time to strike, not even once, but possibly twice. You gotta get it on your stick, drive it through the net. He grabs the puck here at the point. Block a save by Varlamov. This is a fantastic save, James. He's all over it. What I mean by that is he knows exactly where it is and where it's moving, a reason why he can get square to it and make the save. Chicago's game possession along the boards. Trying to get it out of the end. Wolfsburg's going to join the penalty kill here as they remain shorthanded. Takes it to the front. Barlamov's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Nelson's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And that shot dies in traffic. Looks un 
uncomfortable, stretching your body, finding a way to make yourself as big as possible to get to the save. That's what he did, and that's why the save was made. Barcel's really good at creating space for himself, even when he's turning on a dime. Guys, his elite edge's zone ability allows him to carry that speed into those turns and open up some lanes for him to maneuver in. Let's see what he does here. Sent into the offensive zone. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. Great read in the offensive zone by Perry. And that one's turned away. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Clutterbuck's gliding in for the face off as this penalty kill will continue. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Slides it up front. Great vision to see that stretch pass. Shot! Oh, and he just got enough of that to keep it out. And he takes a shot. Oh, and another beauty stop right there. I'm not sure if anyone's helping him out there, but he's dialed in and doing it all himself, making consecutive saves. Power play set to roll on as the setters get ready for the faceoff. And they win the offensive zone faceoff, and here we go. And he takes the dish, and they score! On the power play, they make it happen. James, this is just an absolute clinic and body position how to roll off your coverage, and it's perfectly executed as he doesn't have much time to get the one-timer off, but he gets his stick available and he executes. Chicago's found some offense, and now they suddenly have made this game a lot more interesting here in the second. And they changed the momentum. You can see it in the body language and the confidence. They've got themselves within striking distance of an even game. Quick pass to Romanov. Fires it off net. Morazic's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Lots of time left in this period. The Blackhawks have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. The Islanders will start off on the attack after winning the draw. Jones carries the puck in his own zone. And now he moves it quickly to Perry. Here they come on the attack. Takes a shot. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. And he feeds it down to Ajo. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. The lane was plugged up, and that shot's blocked. Knocks the puck down with a stick. We got a whistle. Penalty coming up. Not a great penalty to take. I mean, you're down a goal. You're trying to fight to get back in this game, and now you find yourself shorthanded. Listen, the power play, you want to make sure that you're getting a high percentage shooting shot. And that's exactly what they did earlier on the 1-3-1, one, one, where they were able to capitalize. It's about opening up lanes, getting the coverage to move around, and then firing and executing when you have it. Close to the crease! Scores! And there's another power play goal! Wow! Well, practice makes perfect, and you know that they've been working on this in practice. They've got the right personnel, the coaching staff has shown them video of how they want it executed, and they deliver tonight. The Islanders are enjoying things in twos. Here in period number two, they've gone up by two, Cheryl. There's been a lot of twos, James, and they'd love to get another couple goals to really pad the stats and increase their lead. But right now, it's about habits, not giving their opponent any life in this game. Knocked away with the stick by Khrushchev. The Blackhawks played along the boards. New York's got it along the wall. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Handles the pass at center. The Blackhawks played along the wing. And that carries off a body in traffic. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. Marcel's been nabbed for tripping. Well, 
I expect that they're going to go back to the umbrella formation, James. They had success earlier on it on the power play with three up high trying to move the coverage. Hey, for everyone who wants to draw it up, it's exactly what it looks like, the top of an umbrella. And then you're getting the coverage to move around, and then you can use those cross-team passes, and you can ski downhill for a shot as well. Puck sails out of the bench, sending a few people ducking. Bedard's ready for the draw on this man advantage. And they win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, and the power play comes up big again. I love the various options that they have on their power play, James. Once the PK adjusts to one, they hit the other. Well, this is a really impressive shot, James. I mean, I'm, I'm looking at this going, man, I don't know if any goaltender would have stopped this. The way he was able to move his feet, corral that puck quickly with that quick release, the snap of the wrist to be able to put it by the tendy. Chicago's looked way more engaged since the start of this period, Cheryl, and now they're starting to get some of the rewards. Well, you can certainly feel the energy. There's two trains of thought here. There's the physical side and there's the emotional side of the game. Both are connected for them right now. Barlamov's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Chicago's shown a new energy over these last few minutes. They got one back, but they still need one more in order to tie. The Blackhawks win the faceoff. Off a stick. Moves it to Tenorti. Passes over to Hall. Quick feed to Perry. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Hall. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Marlamov's been outstanding tonight, James. I mean, he's made the saves he's had to and really given his team an opportunity to win. You can't ask for more than that. Moves it to Barcel. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Moves it quickly over to Wallstrom. Redirected off a stick. Skates across the blue line. And offside, we'll get a reset here. The Blackhawks have had a lot of scoring opportunities, but they continue to trail here in the second. Pachot's won it. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. And he loses control here. Here's a short pass to Radish. There's the whistle as the puck goes out of play. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. New York's got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Engvall. The Islanders take it along the wall. Rips it, and that shot gets caught in traffic. Jones is hauled down. The official's arm is off. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Here comes the call from the official. Well, you can see the coach looks skyward on that third call of the period. They know that they got to get back to even strength and get some kind of offense generated. And the man advantage unit goes right back to work. Well, in a one-goal deficit on the power play now, you have to take advantage. You have to find a way to get the coverage moving and find good scoring opportunities. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Chucked in at the line as that's blocked. Yeah, it's a tough one for the PK unit. You got it on your stick. You got to find a way to clear. Instead, now you're scrambling to get back to defensive position to try and negate this power play. Hope everyone's enjoying the game here tonight. Another big face-off here on this power play. And they get that puck down the ice. Quick feed to Perry. The Blackhawks move it in. Slides it across. And that play's neutralized. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Pachos recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Steps in and takes the puck. Moves it to Perry. Oh, what a stop as he uses his paddle to sweat it away. And Bolton is at the last line of defense for a reason. This time, he bails his team out. Another face-off looming here on this power play.
Pajot's won the draw in his own end. Now let's see if they can clear it. Puck slid down the ice. Sends it quickly to Bedard. Takes the shot. Great save by Varlamov. Well, he was dialed in to make the save with his mask, James, but I don't know how dialed in he's going to be now. He might be a little fuzzy. Pajot is ready for the draws that will continue to try to kill off this penalty. The Islanders win it in the defensive zone. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. The Islanders will play from the defensive zone. And they manage to clear it. Chicago's on the attack. What a steal in his own end. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Bedard's ready for the draw as we get set to resume this power play. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Taken down, and the officials caught it. Here comes the call. Well, when you're looking for a goal, being shorthanded is not ideal. You're also killing valuable time where you can be pressing when you're PKing. And on the heels of that call, we get ourselves a little four on four on the ice. Four on four can be pretty confusing when it comes to coverage. You know that your defense have the forwards, but the forwards have to be able to contain the D as well. So it's complete defense out there. Taken along the wall by Nelson. And he slides it quickly to Ajo. Fantastic save! Chicago's got the puck along the boards. From the point, they take control of it. The Islanders will have a chance to go to work here on the man advantage after the penalty expired. Slides the puck down low. And they continue to apply pressure here. Murphy stick handling in his own zone. Puck cleared from the defensive end. Moves it quickly over to Horvath. Beat the goaltender, but couldn't beat the post. The Islanders here shaking their head. They cannot believe they hit yet another post. Listen, the good part of this is they're still in the lead. And they get the puck out. Nelson scudded across the line. A chance to get it out of harm's way here on this penalty kill. Takes a shot. Oh, what a play to give up the body on the block. And that's a solid clearing attempt on the play. Plays the puck up ahead. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Still some precious time left on this power play as they get set to drop the puck. New York's taking possession in their own end. Huge win by the center to give his team an opportunity to get out of the zone after a critical icing. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Wow, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. The Blackhawks really need to find a way to start finishing on some of these scoring chances because they trail here in the middle. New York's got the win off that draw. Mayfield's moving the puck through his own zone. Still has possession. Picked up along the boards by Mayfield. Hall's got the puck in his own zone. Poked away at center by Mayfield. There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. This is a frustrating situation, James. Just taking a whack load of penalties and really unable to get any momentum in this game because they're shorthanded the whole time. The power play unit goes right back to work. Well, they create a power play opportunity with hard work, and now it's an opportunity to get back in this game, James. Finding a way to move the puck quickly and create seams to get shots on net. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Here's a chance! Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Puck clears the zone. The Blackhawks gain possession. Dishes it to Donato. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. 
Play whistle dead as the puck goes into the bench, and I think that woke up a few players. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Horvath's won the draw here in the defensive zone. They clear the zone. And now he tries to get it across to Perry. The Islanders have possession shorthanded. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And the puck clears the zone. That's why you want players with active sticks on your PK, James. They can close quickly and they can corral the puck and just fire it down the ice. And that's poked away by Dobson. The Blackhawks have it against the wall. And down he goes as the puck goes free. at the stop. Oh, you gotta love this stuff, James. The game within the game, and this is a one-on-one -on -one battle, and this goaltender, he knows exactly where he's at, and he wins it. That opportunity is rejected. Can't maintain possession. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. We gotta stop it just the puck sails over the glass. Pachot's side still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. The Blackhawks win the draw. Here's a short pass to Hall. Sends the pass in front. Couldn't complete the pass. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Nice job to escape the zone. Mayfield's almost out of the box. Oh, a clutch save! And they score! There's number 40 for the rookie! It's hard to believe he's a rookie, James. I mean, he looks like a savvy veteran out there. When the puck is on his dick, he's poised. He's so patient. I mean, his possession numbers are off the charts. This guy is absolutely incredible. Well, the coach is going to like this goal. It's all about the effort and habits, not turning away from the net after the original shot, James, but continuing to track it and able to deposit in the net. More than half the period has expired. It's all tied up. Chicago's won the draw. Quick pass to Perry. Shot! That goes off the blocker. What a save by Varlamov. Taken by Bedard. Can't get it to go. And now it's grabbed by Romanov. Quick feed to Wallstrom. Here's a shot. Comes up with the stop. Chicago's got possession of the puck. Murphy's lugging the puck. Excellent stick work on the play. The Islanders look to start the transition game. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Shot! There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Getting into the later stages of this period. We got a tie game. The Blackhawks win the defensive zone face-off. Sends the pass over. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Wallstrom. And he slides it quickly to Thompson. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Donato's hauled down, penalty on the way. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. Let's see what the officials say. Well, the refs are calling a really tight game, and man, this has been a parade to the penalty box, and the entire bench looks agitated, and as a result, they keep taking more. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the faceoff. Power play has scored today, but hasn't been excellent. This is where coaches make adjustments, whether you go with PP1 or PP2, or even if you intermix them. And the puck leaves the zone. Grabbed along the board by Bedard. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. And they clear that puck. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. The Islanders get a hold of the puck under man. The feed. And that carries off a body in the lane. Gets in front of it for the block. And they send it down the ice. 
Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Looks to get the puck over to Hall. Moves it around along the half wall. The Islanders gain possession of the defensive zone. And the puck clears the zone. Chicago's in on the offensive attack now. Oh, that has some heat on it. He makes the save. Big save by the goaltender once again. Donato's ready to take the draw here on this power play. And they win the draw on their own end. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. Grabs control of it at the point. Receives the pass. Oh, what a slick stop by Morazic. This is an impressive save right here, James. I mean, there's a ton of net front presence, and so a lot of traffic that he has to battle through to find the puck, and he does, and he makes a nice save. And he's knocked off the puck there. The Blackhawks take it from the side. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Sends it to the middle. Off the stick, and they can't complete the play. Both sides are evened up as the power play has expired. Well, that's a great job by the PK all the way from the entry, even once the power play unit got in. The ability to read the ice and know exactly where you want to go and where to pressure, that takes some skill. It's not just the power play that has it. Trust me, I know. Fires it with the start. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. Late goings of this period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Marzell's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. And that's poked away in the offensive zone by Pellet. Moves it to Marcel. Thompson's got the puck along the wing. Poked away in the neutral zone by Athanasiu. Play is blown dead with the offside. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. The Islanders win possession here in the open ice. Sends it out front, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Fans urging for a shot on goal in the dying seconds. Takes a shot. Oh, fantastic stop there. Well, there you go. Two periods down, one more to go, at least for now, right? Third period just around the corner. Fans, your donations have made it possible for kids in need to see good Two down, one to go. Third period, they're ready to drop the puck. No shortage of offensive highlights in this one. Let's see if that carries over here as we are underway in the third. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Across the line. Moves it quickly over to Pellet. Rocked him in the open ice. New York's got it in their own zone. Huge hit against the glass. I love the physicality in this game, but now there's going to be a stoppage in play, James, as that glass, it is broken. We're still in the early stages of this period. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. his own face off and he wins the draw and that's off target as it hits a body here's a short pass to nelson oh textbook poke check to turn that over harry stick explodes and he grabs another one from the bench and gets back into play right away moves the puck into the attacking area fires it into the offensive zone through center along the wing here they come on the rush quick shot Talk about sacrifice, what a block. Here's a blast. Good check, frees the puck up. Passes it over to Perry. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Quick pass across to Wallstrom. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Picked up along the wall by Wallstrom. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. 
Slides it diagonally to Radish. On the attack along the boards. To the low slot. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Lee. New York's got it in their own zone. With some open space at center. Along the half wall with the puck. Picked up along the boards by Horvat. Takes a shot. And he comes up big with the stick save. Getting all of it with the paddle. Slides it to Kurashev. New York's got the puck. Quick pass to Paul Mary. The Islanders gain the zone. Slides the puck over. Quick feed to Athanasiu. Puck picked up by Engvall. Puts it on net. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. The Islanders gain control of the puck. Looks to set up at the point now. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. And they're going to be short-handed once again, much to the chagrin of these fans. What is that? Is that three in a row now? Yeah, that's three in a row. You got it. And the fans certainly don't like it, but it's not up to them, is it? But now they're back to the PK. So difficult to get any kind of flow in a game when you're marching to the penalty box. The Blackhawks once again send out their power play unit. Although the power play hasn't been great, it has converted. To convert again, they're going to have to find a way to create those openings, get the coverage outside of the dots, and find a way to capitalize. Takes a bump, but still hangs on to the puck. Makes a move in front! And scores! Making a hat trick in the first in the rookie's career! Wow, what a great night and a moment that he'll never forget. And his entire team coming over to him. Celebrating with him, he's on the road. There it is, and he's leading his team in goals for a reason, James. He's got a real knack for the net and uncanny ability to disguise his shot. What a special moment here for the youngster with his first career hat trick. And and I'm sure there's some proud parents watching right now, too. Yeah, I mean, and the athlete himself. I mean, just proud of his performance tonight. You're never expecting to get a hat trick or anyone on the ice, let alone a rookie. And that's going to be a huge confidence builder. And you know that the coaching staff loves it. They're finding a guy that's got a knack for the net. Chicago's looking to break out. And it's a quick pass to Perry. Puck scooped up by Jones. Poked away in the offensive zone by Bedard. Now a quick pass to Wallstrom. Sends a pass over. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And that's off a stick. Here's a shot. Scores! Just a fantastic shot. I mean, the goaltender is saying, hey, try and beat me glove hand. Well, guess what? He does. The Islanders get the equalizer, and look at this. With the time of this game, huge, Cheryl. Huge goal with respect to timing as well, James. Not only is it the equalizer, it tells me one thing. They made the adjustments that they talked about in the intermission. A great start to the third. Tosses it on to Dickinson. The Blackhawks looking against the half wall. Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Chicago's going to play it from the corner. Takes the puck at the point. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Gauthier's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, pad save. Tremendous. Just agility there by Brasic. Puts it just wide of the net. Well, this shot is really hard, James, but a nice reminder that if it isn't accurate, it doesn't stand a chance. Right. I'm gonna see who's got it in the offensive zone. Quick shot, and that's off the club and will play on. Gains the zone through center. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Takes the pass. Great save by the goaltender to get a pass. Keeping the puck out of the net. 
slides it over with pace to Pajo. The Islanders gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Taken along the wall by Engvall. Let's it go. Off the mask of the goaltender. Born right between the eyes. Well, no smelling salts needed here. He's shaking it off as he takes one in the cage. He made the save, so that's going to make him pretty happy. Moves it to Kurosha. To Marisov with the one-timer save. Wow. Takes the feed. And that's turned aside by Harlamov. And somehow he hangs on. Moves it quickly over to Lee. Moves the puck along the half wall. Good hit on the play. Kurashev's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. And yet another penalty is called, so out comes the PK unit. And you know what? They are taxed. They are worn down. If this continues, it's all going to backfire. Hot 
Hicks with a five on three, and they've got loads of time to work with here. Oh, and that is a lot of time on a five on three. You have to have a sense of urgency here, though, because if you pop one by, you still have the man advantage. They get it out of the defensive end. Great four check by Jones. Marlamov's been so impressive, in particular in that last sequence, James, and he's out of gas. It didn't prevent him from making that save, but now he's going to get some much-needed rest as that puck heads out of his zone. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. Chicago's got it now. Stops him with a glove. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. Pajot's recognizing they're still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. The Islanders win the draw. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Quick feed to Donato. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. New York's been excellent tonight, James. They found ways to work hard on and off of the puck. And when they're away from it, they've really done a great job of being in good position to be able to take away lanes and angles, seams, you name it. But it has to translate to something. This is still a close game. Bedard's ready for the draw this man advantage. New York's won the draw. Under siege, trying to get it out of their zone. Here's a chance in front! And he denies that great opportunity there. Chicago's got a hold of it along the wall. Blocked in traffic. New York's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded. And the puck clears the zone. Solid check to slow him down. Works it across to Athanasiu. Paul Mary's back out onto the ice, and they will continue to play shorthanded here. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. Horvat's ready for the draw as they continue to be shorthanded here. The Islanders get a hold of the draw. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Looks to pass it to Radish. Chicago's got the puck in their own end. And they send it right back to him. And that goes off a of body. They fight for it along the boards. And it's freed up over to his teammate with a nice kick pass. And they get the puck out of the danger zone. The Islanders get back to even strength after a huge effort by their penalty killers. The next shift is critical, James. They had the opportunity on the power play to get back in it and get the equalizer. Now they're down by one, so they have to manage some energy here, and they have to dictate pace and get back in the game. New York's won the defensive zone draw. Passes the puck over to Lee. And that's snapped away in the defensive end by Murphy. Moves it to Bedard. The Blackhawks pick up steam and are on the attack. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Aho. New York's got it in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Paul Mary. Here's a shot. And he stakes that one with the club. Reaction time is everything when you're a goaltender, and that's what you see from a young age, them working on all of those different drills to help them with these kinds of saves. Just flash the leather and make the save. What a glove hand. Chicago's looking to break out of their own end. Perry's got it against the boards. Oh, tremendous glove save by Varlamov. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. He doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Here in the late going of the frame, the Islanders are holding on to a one-goal lead. It's 5-4. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. We got a whistle as the puck goes out of play. Chicago's running out of time. They need to find a goal here quickly as they trail late in the third. The Islanders win the draw. Chicago's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Slides it across to Kurashev. New York's got possession here in the neutral zone. And that's knocked away by Murphy. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Cutting to the slot. Gives them nothing in front. A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender to task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. 
A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Barzell's won the face-off. Oh, and that's poked away in the offensive zone by Bedard. He carries the puck up along the wing. Strong defensive effort. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Here's a short pass to Wallstrom. A chance in front! Morazic's gonna hang on for a whistle. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. The Islanders take possession off the faceoff. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Makes it look easy with the stop. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The Islanders play it along the boards. Break away! Oh, too much save here in this third period! Uh, it's a close game, and you know it's the third period, and the next goal is pivotal, and you want that one back, certainly for the shooter. Nearing the final minute of the third. That's on the stick. Rocks it on the play. Into the offensive end now. Quick pass to Clutterbuck. Oh, what a save in front. Takes the feed. Hall's got the puck. Goaltender has made his way to the bench. The extra attacker's out. They need a goal here big time. Scooped up along the wall by Romanov. And now he moves it quickly to Pajo. The Islanders move the puck in the defensive zone. Quick feed to Radish. Beautiful read in the defensive end by Dobson. New York's working hard in all the way. Towards the empty net. Misses. And the final horn sounds for this one. Wallstrom's hat trick leads the way on route to victory tonight. Yeah, he got himself in the position, didn't he? He's a pure goal scorer, and he didn't disappoint tonight. Well, from the squared circle to the ice, the yes chant has taken over everywhere, it seems. Yeah, this is a tradition now, and these fans are incredible, aren't they? I mean, they're just giving it back right at their team, and vice versa. The yes chant is alive in the stadium. Great night of action on the ice, and I can't wait to do it again. I know you can't wait either, so we'll see you next time, and we'll see you back.